Hello and great to have the pleasure of your company. Our match today comes to you from the Estadio Presidente Perón. My name is Derek Ray and my commentary partner as usual is Stuart Robson. And what we're getting ready to bring you is live action from La Liga Profesional de Football. It's Racing and they take on Tigre. Thanks Derek as always, this should be a good game. Great atmosphere inside the stadium, we've got two teams full of quality, some interesting matchups, and two coaches that want to play an attractive brand of football. What more could you ask for? This is how it looks for the home side. Well, the wingers will be key here. They have to choose the right time to give width and the right time to come infield to support the centre forward. If they can do that, they're a potent front three. No doubt about that. And introducing the visitors lineup today. Well, they're starting with an attacking 4 5 1 formation with three players in advance of two holding midfielders. But it's important that the wide players come in field to join the centre forward at the right time. Gracias por estar aquí. And so the battle commences. Morales. Effective challenge. Fantastic work to thwart the danger. Well, he read that brilliantly at the back. And the cross has promise. An utterly disappointing cross. Goal kick. Menossi. Read it well. El dueño de un tres puertas amarillo de marca francesa que se acerque al parque. En Sua. Matías Rojas. Miranda with it. Moving into the advanced position. And they have possession again. Castro. And a really single-minded piece of defending to make sure nothing untoward happened. Carbonero. Really good block. Castro, this looks threatening. Interception to snuff out the danger. Strong play here. I oh, couldn't quite find his teammate. Johan Carbonero. Well, doesn't have to do it on his own. And blocked for now. Menossi. Going well. Who can he pick out? Well, it was pretty straightforward for the goalkeeper.
and intercepts again. Over the touchline for a throw in. Firing it in. Well, they would have been disappointed had he spilled that one. Well, there we have it. This has been a really poor game so far. The players need to pick up the tempo and be a lot braver with their passing and their movement. This can only get better. It's with Moreno. A chance to whip it in. Still level here, but the pressure escalating. Must take the lead here. And they have. You've got to say, it has been coming. Well, here you can see it again. Good run, great strength, and a composed finish under pressure. That's a top-class goal. So the match has restarted, 1-0 here. Colidio. And they know they need to stop him. Oh, good defending to stop a decent-looking attack. And the fourth official confirming that we'll have one additional minute. And that is going to be a free kick. And the managers will now deliver their half-time team talks. We're at the end of 45 minutes in this game. We certainly have got to give this man high marks for his work up to this point, Stuart. Well, I'm sure the manager will be delighted with him. He'll have drilled it into them to keep their focus, keep playing through to the half-time whistle, and it's certainly put them in a good position to go on and win this now. So the two teams have switched around and the second half is underway. And a strong tackle. And support available. And he takes it away. Maximiliano Romero. It's with Lucas Menossi. And a tidy challenge. Under pressure, doesn't seem to be bothering him. Racing forward, trying to catch them out. And he might be through here. And a long way out. And a really good diving stop. Substitution then. Let's see how it affects the match.
Who can they pick out? Not quite the clearance they were hoping for. Just the challenge that was required. Can they create something from here? Has a go. High echelon goalkeeping there. And they will make the change now. Let's see about the delivery. Well, as a defender, that will sit you down to the ground. Fantastic work to thwart the danger. Colidio. Well, we have 20 minutes left in this game. And the ball's gone. Well, it could be on for him here. Oh, it's in! A two-goal cushion now, and the lead fully merited. Well, here's the replay, and he's got to clear his lines there. He doesn't do that. He has his pocket picked, and he's been rightly punished. Poor defending. So the ball rolling again at 2-0. Oh, moving it nicely. And the last touch off the defender. So a corner coming up. Played over. And the cross comes to nothing. Menossi. Blondel. Now he must favour the cross. And making the move to the inside. And able to get a body in the way. Counter-attacking, very much an option. Good-looking sequence. Really vital interception here. And providing width. POV Gabriel Auche and the referee has added on two minutes of stoppage time he could pick out a teammate and there it is the final whistle and the fans will be leaving the stadium with smiles on their faces well Derek they were better than their opponents in all aspects of the game they defended well enough, they dominated midfield and they created chances as well. It was a great performance. Well, Stuart, he really has had a lot to say for himself out on the pitch. Well, I thought he was excellent. Not only did he score a good goal, but his general play was outstanding. He certainly played a major part in their win here today.